Tonight we have joining us from Middle Tennessee State, the stud running back from their win against Georgia Tech. It's Benny Cunningham. Benny, thanks for joining us tonight. Thank you for having me. I appreciate being on. Well, I just referenced the game that you had, a monster performance, 217 yards rushing and five touchdowns. How were you able to have so much success against the Yellow Jackets defense? Uh, I really feel like the offensive line just took control of the game. Uh, the coaches gave me a lot of opportunities, you know, during the game. So, you know, how we could practice just really paid off against them. Well, how much credit do you have to give your offensive line? Obviously, I know it's a team effort, but what did you do for those guys? You take them to, out to a nice, expensive steak dinner that will probably get you in trouble with the NCAA? <laughs> uh, nah, uh, I, ain't, I, I don't have it made like that yet. Uh, just, uh, just happen to be close enough friends that they'll put it on the line for me. No, that's dope, man. Your team has had a lot of problems with the ACC. I think you've gone uh, two and nine recently. So how big was this win for you guys moving forward? Uh, I feel like it was a huge win for the program, you know, and uh, it really builds confidence for the uh, guys on the team, you know, to know that if we can play against a bigger conference than us, then there's no reason we shouldn't be able to play against anybody. How impressed have you been with some of the wins out of the Sun Belt? Your opponent this week, Louisiana Monroe, has had some win earlier beating Arkansas. You guys now get a chance at those guys. What's practice been like leading up to this game? Uh, I mean, I've, I've been really impressed. You know, I feel like the Sun Belt's uh, getting better every year. And uh, it's just real, been a real physical practice. You know, I feel like it's going to be a dog fight. Uh, I feel like they're a similar team to us. You know, they, uh, they don't care who they're going against. You know, they're going to go out there and play hard. All right, Benny, I was actually excited for you to come on to the show because what people need to know is Middle Tennessee State is at the same exit as one of the greatest Cracker Barrels in the world. It is fantastic, man. I went there, and I spent so much time in the bathroom, I had to pay rent. So my nickname is now Donkey Kong because they say I break barrels. Do you have a nickname? Uh, no, uh, teammates just call me Benny. <laughs> nice. 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 Keep, keep it simple. Hey, you got it like that. You can roll like that. They don't give you like the jet, like Benny and the Jets, that Elton John song? Uh, no, I actually heard that my whole life, but I kind of brushed it off. <laughs> there you but go. I've been hearing the well, Benny and the Jets since a young age. Well, maybe we'll have to start something then. We'll be Benny and the Jets from now on. I would like Benny that. the Jet. <laughs> he keeps out more performances like that. All right, Benny Cunningham <laughs> from Middle Tennessee State, thank you for coming on with us tonight. Good luck this weekend. I appreciate you for having me. Thanks.